Time now for Sid Sixero. This is where I got 60 seconds to talk about stuff. Start the clock, please. Here's what's on my mind this morning. Imagine you had to go about your day with a high ankle sprain. I don't care what you do for a living. High ankle sprain. That will impede you in a lot of ways. Now, for a moment, imagine trying to win the Super Bowl on this. A high, a high ankle sprain. This was Patrick Mahomes last week against Jacksonville after suffering an aforementioned high ankle sprain. Now, the talk all week ahead of the semifinals yesterday was, how would he be? The answer was not too bad. Not too bad at all, actually. Not only did he throw a couple touchdowns against Cincinnati, but he ran well on the high ankle sprain. This was late in the game. There's also a penalty here on Cincinnati. It was just the type of Mahomes, quite frankly, I was not expecting to see. It is a serious injury. It does not heal quickly, and it impedes a lot of normal people, let alone professional athletes, who depend on your ankle to win football games and advance to the Super Bowl, which the Chiefs did yesterday. Eagles, Chiefs, Super Bowl in a little less than two weeks' time. Mahomes is not from this planet. J.D. Bunkus from Sportsnet 590, the fan. J.D. Bunkus podcast joining us 9 to 11 daily on Sportsnet 590, the fan. Listen, J.D., I know there was some iffy refereeing last night. I know that's getting a lot of the play today. Let's not glaze over this. Let's not overlook this. This is outstanding what he pulled off, and I can't quite figure it out. City's he's magic. You didn't even mention that he was down to three wide receivers. His star tight end had back spasms so bad that it was questionable whether he was going to be in that game. And he was playing on one leg. And the game deciding play is him running to the sideline. I actually think that the Bengals player that it takes that penalty that basically steals the game, he may have hit him because he was just so frustrated. He's like, I, I can't believe you. I can't believe all week we prepped for a guy <laughs> on one foot. And now he's running outside of the pocket, picking up a first down against us. Whatever. I'm taking this shove. I'm taking my liberty. There were moments where Mahomes looked a little uncomfortable. There were moments where he was clearly wincing in pain. But this is a guy who still the camera work is showing the footwork in the pocket. Again, on one foot. He's still throwing for over 300 yards in an NFC Championship game. And now he's going back to another Super Bowl, already his third. No, he's magic. He's spectacular. Whatever superlative you want to use, that's Patrick Mahomes. You know, there's, there's something about sports, J.D., and playing through significant significant injury that will put you like in legendary regardless if you're good or not it'll put you yeah. in legendary status forever uh kurt schilling bloody sock bobby bond a broken leg wins a stint like it doesn't matter what it is where do you put yesterday and really if you want to go back a week against jacksonville throw it there as well where do you put this among the crazy sports heroic moments of all time in about a minute i still love mj flu game and I think the underrated one is Dirk Nowitzki being incredibly sick, sick, beating the 2006 Miami Heat. I think that one gets a little underrated. But this is football, Sid. This is football. They're going to hit you. <laughs> They're going to step on your legs. Look at the size of those Bengals players that are coming out his ankles. Of course, it's spectacular. It, like, yeah, it's, it's one of the more impressive feats I can remember. And it's one of the times that I'll always carry of never underestimated Patrick Mahomes. Yeah, the, the, the MJ flu game was fun. Or the hungover game. Whatever. We could debate all day. We could debate yeah. all day. Uh, J.D. Bunkus, Sportsnet 590, the fan. Lots to talk about today. 9 to 11 on the fan. Good stuff, J.D. Appreciate you. Thank you. Thanks, brother. Another crazy weekend at sports.